Hey, what is up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome to Games and Recreations. My name is Francisco, and I am your host for today. So today, we're kind of testing out a couple of things, and I'm also going to review my microphone, my new microphone. But first things first, let me tell you about what I'm testing out. So I just went out and got myself the uh, Elgato CamLink, the uh, 4K version of it. Not that I'm using 4K, but that was the only one available, so that's the one I bought. I actually now have my camera, my DSLR, my Panasonic Lumix G7 camera hooked up to my computer using it directly as my webcam. I am incredibly excited. It looks absolutely beautiful and it's awesome. $129.99 for the cam link and like another 20 bucks for a micro, UHB, a micro HDMI cable. And now you can have amazing stellar quality for your webcam feed to your streams or for YouTube videos, whatever you wanna do, it's gonna look crisp and beautiful, which is one of the things I'm testing this video out for right now. Anywho, the real purpose of the video is we're gonna talk about this microphone right here, and this microphone is the AKG P120 condenser microphone, XLR condenser microphone, right? Along with it, I am using, because you have to have a USB interface to use XLR microphones on your computer, the Scarlett Solo USB interface right here. Boop, this guy. It's a mwah, pretty little thing. Okay, so here's the deal. These two right here, oh my God, hold it right. These two right here cost me a total of about $267. The microphone was on sale at Guitar Center and this thing was roughly, I wanna say like 110 and some change and I bought the warranty so that's why it came out to 260. So here's my deal. Why do I have a new microphone and what do I do? So I like to create content. I am a gamer. I do YouTube. I do, I did Twitch. I do Twitch from time to time, but I'm more onto like YouTube streaming now instead. And uh, I do a podcast, a weekly forecast. You can find us over on Spotify, iTunes, Google Play, Podbean, etc. We're there. Check it out. Weekly show. It's amazing. You're going to love it. So I used to have the Blue Yeti microphone and I have my Blue Yeti microphone, I want to say for roughly three, three and a half years. And it was an incredible microphone. It was a great entry level microphone. Uh, it sounded amazing. It had a few things I didn't like about the microphone. Uh, it would pick up a lot of crazy noise. And if you plugged it into the wrong USB port, your voice would suddenly sound chopped and screwed like this, Merck. Or, you know, or if you were too close to a power source, you'd be like, Ee! like that. Very annoying, easy to work around and easy to work through, but ultimately I decided that after three and a half years, it was time to upgrade, time to get something a little more professional, time to get something a little better sounding. So I did some research and even though I was this close to buying the Shure SM7B microphone, I decided to not spend $400 on the microphone. I could have, but I used my better judgment and I did. Number one, I don't have that big of a following to warrant buying a $400 microphone. Maybe as we get bigger, as the community gets larger and people start you know, really listening to our content and, and, and consuming it, then maybe I can think about getting a better microphone. But I went to Guitar Center and they had a little kiosk there. We could test out all these microphones and I ran into this beautiful little thing, the AKG P120 microphone. I put their Audio-Technica headsets on and I started talking to it. I was like, hi, my name is Frank. Hey, it's your boy Frank. Yo, what's up, dude? Stuff like that. And I was like, holy crap, for $89.99, this microphone sounds as good, if not better, than the Blue Yeti that you can get for like $130. Here's the catch. You have to buy a USB interface to do this, right? It's not so simple as a Blue Yeti where it's plug and play and you're good to go. But I do feel that there is a big difference in quality, at least for me. Now, I've read articles online talking about how there's not that much of a difference between a USB plug and play microphone and an XLR microphone in terms of sound quality, but I beg to differ. Now, I'm not a professional, but I'm just going off of what I hear. I've been listening to my old content that I recorded with the Blue Yeti, and I've been listening to our podcast that I've recorded with the AKG P120, and I gotta say, this thing sounds amazing. It's beautiful, it's so crisp and clear and the microphone is so small and pretty. I got this nice little windscreen for it to make it look even bigger than what it really is. I got a new black boom stand just for the mic itself. I blacked it out. My Blue Yeti was silver. Um, I hate to admit it, but I will. I really changed the microphone just because I wanted something black to go with it. And I was about to get the Yeti Caster bundle. I decided, no, let's just get something a little more professional sounding. Um, 
in terms of anything else, really, I mean, I have not had a single problem using this microphone. No technical difficulties, no sound quality issues, nothing, nothing at all. I literally plugged in the USB interface to the back of my computer. I plugged the microphone in with the cable, the appropriate XLR cable, and boom, that's it, done. All I had to do at that point was just mess around with the gain to my liking, and you'll do the same to your liking. And after that, it was all said and done, and I was recording, and it sounded beautiful. Now, sometimes I do have to get nice and close to the microphone so that I can sound really, really, really good. And sometimes if I'm speaking loud enough, I can sit at a distance, usually eh, about you know six or so inches away. It does pick up everything. Like, my wife will be in the living room watching Friends or Bob's Burgers or something, and if I'm not careful, I can pick up all that audio, which is perfectly fine. So what you do in that sense is, as you start recording, just sit in silence for like 10 seconds. Like that. And what you do then is you go into Audacity and you select uh, Noise Cleaning and noise reduction for that you know, five, 10 second amount of time, and it'll pick up all the ambient noise and everything else, and it'll just clean it out of your audio, and you're done. After that, it's smooth sailing. Uh, give you all a little test of the audio. So right now, you know, this is about where I would sit and when I'm recording my podcast, when I'm playing games, when I'm streaming or recording for YouTube purposes, but maybe, maybe we should test and see what it sounds like when you're a little further away. So now I'm a little further back. And, you know, obviously there's going to be some distance between me and the mic. You're not going to hear me as clearly, but you should still be able to make out what I'm saying. And now I'm all the way back here. All the way to the end of my room. I actually have my electrical panel right here. Um, you should probably still be able to hear me. I can see OBS, the sound from my microphone moving back and forth. You can still kind of make out what I'm saying, but I'm not going to sound as clear. So, obviously, it's going to be some issues for you if you're standing this far back trying to talk to your microphone. So, that being said, you definitely want to be nice and close to the microphone when you're speaking to it. Don't yell. You know, there's no need to yell. Yelling, yelling is terrible. I, uh, sometimes I yell, but don't, just don't do it. Don't yell, okay? So, here's the deal. Hey, I'm new to gaming and streaming and content creation. Do I need to get this microphone? If you got the money for it, yes. If you don't, there's plenty of other more affordable options uh, for entry-level content creators. The Blue Snowball or the Blue Yeti. You're good. You do those two micro either one of those two, and you're great. Hey, I've been content creating for a while now, and I'm trying to find something a little better. First of all, that's up for debate. I'll be honest with you. I, again, I got this out of pure vanity's sake, okay? But I am incredibly happy with the quality. If that's the case, if you're that second-level content creator, you've been at it for a while, and you're trying to upgrade your sound, and just look, you know more professional, then absolutely, AKG P120 microphone is incredible. They have a slightly higher level microphone that sounds a lot better, and I think it comes with its own windscreen. I didn't get that, it didn't really, the price wasn't justified for me, but you know, whatever. So, ladies and gentlemen, that's really about it when it comes in terms to the microphone. It is small, it is incredibly portable, it's very well built, it's not gonna break or fall on, or if you fall and drop it, it won't break on you, but I wouldn't recommend it. The lady at Guitar Center also said, hey, like, treat it with care. Don't just go knocking it around all over the place because you might have some problems then. But as long as your your equipment is secured safely to your desk or to whatever it is, you're going to be fine. I love this microphone. I have not regretted it for one bit. I've had it for well over a month. I've been using it very, 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 very consistently day in and day out for my content and for my podcast and for YouTube and for streaming. You're going to love the microphone. It sounds amazing. It will make you sound sexy. And who does not want to sound sexy on our content? Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, I hope this video helped. That's all I've got for you today. My name is Francisco here from Games and Recreations. Check us out over on youtube.com slash GNR underscore. Actually, it's no underscore. Just GNR Frank. GNR Frank. Check us out there. Listen to our podcast over at... Uh, you can check us out on Podbean. You can check me out on Spotify and iTunes and Google Play. It's called The Weekly Farcast, F-A-R-C-A-S-T, The Weekly Farcast. Shout out to my boy Ricky and Angel from Rapid City for being amazing partners. Love y'all very much. Y'all take care. Be good to yourselves and be good to one another. Peace.